All right, guys, hello, and welcome back to my channel. My name is Alex, and today I am going to be walking you all through a little Target haul. I went to Target this morning. Today is Monday, September 4th, so it is Labor Day. Also, it is my birthday in two days, so I felt like, you know, I was able to kind of um, purchase a couple pieces for myself. And because I had the day off today, I wanted to grab a couple of things that I needed. And while I was grabbing those couple of things that I needed, I got distracted in the clothing department because everything was 20% off. So I wanted to show you a couple of the pieces that I got. I did try to be practical with it and I made sure that everything that I got uh, were things that I could wear to work as I don't like to waste a lot of money on things I can't wear to work just because I like to invest in pieces that I can pretty much wear anytime, any day. So if you would like to see some of the pieces that I shopped for this fall season, then just keep watching. Okay, so I'm just gonna go ahead and start with the non-clothing items that I got. One of the first things were these Undeniable Beauty Ollie gummies. I saw these on one of the best hair, skin, and nail vitamin list last night and then I saw them at Target so I went ahead and picked these up. They taste delicious. They taste really high quality. And then I have been a fan of these Dashing Diva Gloss nail strips for a while now. These are the ones that I did, oh gosh, probably two weeks ago and they still are holding up great. My nails are growing underneath them and I just really love the look of them. So I went ahead and picked up another palette. These ones are called the Lavender Dreams and it looks kind of gray on camera, but it's more of like a lavender gray and then the accents are really beautiful. I love like a, a shiny glittery accent. I don't know if you can tell, but these ones are kind of like gold foil, like leaves and flowers and things like that. So I thought that was really pretty for fall. And then the next thing that I picked up was one of these peel off face masks from Kbella detoxifying charcoal peel off face masks. I actually gave my fiance a facial yesterday and I used this on him and the peeling off, it peels off really well um, as long as it's not too thin. The beard was really difficult, but yeah, it peels off really nicely and it's also really satisfying to peel off. So I wanted to go ahead and grab another one of these. And I actually used the leftover mask from him, his yesterday and I gave myself a facial today. And I feel like my skin is just much more glowy. And as you're peeling it off, all of this like little, you know, dead skin and hair and um, like blackheads and stuff come off in the mask. And it's super, super nice. And I feel like it really does make a difference in your skin. So I went ahead and picked up another one of those as well. So all right, so the first outfit that I grabbed, I'm gonna go ahead and show you guys this one first because it's the most like summer to fall outfit. I saw these cream colored linen pants and I just thought they were really comfortable looking. I like to be comfortable at work. So I went ahead and decided to try these on. They have pockets in the front and in the back. And then I went ahead and picked up this little sort of red burnt orangey tank top to go with and I thought that these would be a really nice pairing. Normally I would be a size medium, but I did want a little bit more of a tighter fit for the tank top. So I got a small, nice size down. All right, so this next piece is actually a dress by the brand Knox Rose. And I just thought the pattern was really beautiful. It's long sleeves, it buttons at the wrists and it goes to just about above knee length. It is a little bit roomy. They didn't have any smalls left, so I grabbed the medium. It's a little bit roomy around the waist, and so I think I'm gonna grab one of those 
little um, waist cincher, fabric, whatever cincher things off of Amazon just to kind of cinch the waist in a little bit. All right, so I can't really see the bottom of it, but I will show you. It does have pockets, which is really, really nice. We love pockets. And I went, went ahead and paired her with some cute purple little buckle boots. Again, I just really love the fabric. It's giving like witchy October vibes. And if I get one of those little waist cinchers, then I would probably just kind of cinch the waist back like so. Okay, so next up we have this really beautiful flannel. It's super, super soft and it's like an oversized fit. Thought that this would be cute paired with jeans or leggings. Okay, so I went ahead and paired this with my favorite lucky jeans. and a cream tank top, as well as some brown boots. And again, it's just really, really soft and would be perfect for those chillier fall days. Okay, so this last piece that I got, I was really indecisive about, so hopefully it serves me well. It's this really beautifully colored, like chocolate brown fleece lined cropped hoodie, but it's not so cropped that I can't wear it to work. And it is just so soft. Perfect for those comfier, cozier days. doesn't have like a front pocket, but I think that's okay. Usually I don't really store anything in my front hoodie pockets anyway, because it just kind of looks bulky. So I don't really mind that. It's got a nice open neckline. Let's check out the hood. And a really big hood for if it rains. So yeah, I'm definitely glad I picked this up. I was really indecisive about it. Again, everything was 20% off, so I thought, why not treat myself to a little birthday fall splurge? So Venus has also gone direct, so we don't need to worry about making purchases on anything related to beauty or aesthetic. We don't need to worry about regretting those purchases. A lot of astrologers will tell you that you need to wait until the shadow period is over, but Venus has officially gone direct, so I'm feeling a little bit more inspired for the fall season. Anyways, guys, thank you so much for being here. Thank you for watching. I hope you enjoyed this fall haul, and we'll see you in the next video. Bye. I should probably untangle these. I'm not doing this on camera. Not the best idea. Aha.